Hi everybody, it's me again. Um, this is day five with me using my muesli and today was a check-in for me as well. Um, so I had to do the pictures, the front and the side pictures and I was looking back on the day that I started was the 29th, which was my birthday by the way. Huh, didn't even mention that earlier. Um, so I did a side-by-side -side of the 29th and today and I see a slight lightness um, it might be wishful thinking, but it looked a little lighter, not, oh, kind of light, but it looked, you know, a little bit. So maybe, hopefully, we're on our way to lightening this a little bit. Okay. I washed my face with my Lumi. Uh-huh. And I did use my 180, of course. And I did find out about this today, too, that you can use this as a mask as well. You could do it three or four days a week in about 15, 20 minutes, leave it on. And it, it is supposed to lighten um, skin discoloration. I don't know if it's supposed to lighten melasma. They didn't say that. It's like sun damage kind of thing. So it might help a little, I don't know. So I think I'm gonna try it um, tomorrow day or in the afternoon before I come back on and um, and see how it was and then tell y'all about it too to see you know if there was any side effects or if it did anything at all so I'm gonna try that tomorrow okay so we're doing the muesli again the erase 2.5 percent whatever that word is you all know I can't pronounce that word okay one pump pea size that pump worked that time okay got this a little runny but it could be because it's so humid in this house today. We've had some rain and it's been very humid. Okay, so I'm going to put it here. And I have not experienced any burning or any peeling yet. Thank goodness. Um, my face was a little warm throughout the day. But I think it was because I had too much salt. You know, I really do because... For breakfast, I had, you know, turkey. I did have turkey bacon and scrambled eggs for breakfast, but dinner I had pasta with, you know, tomato sauce. So it was pretty salty, but anyway, so I don't think it's from the melasma is what I'm saying. I think it's from my diet. Okay, got that on. Let me wash my hands real quick because, oh yeah, right here. All right. Now, we'll let that soak in real good. See, it's still... My face feels really flush today, but I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, um, still no itching neither. I haven't had any, just the warmth, but like I said, that very well could be my diet too. So um, I am going to use this again tonight because I really like this and it's a little bit thicker, especially since my face is kind of warm today. I think I'm going to use this instead. It's a little bit thicker, a little bit better, I think, than the Neutrogena, which I do like this. It's a nice lightweight. I wear this every morning. I put it on. Then I use my sunscreen, which um, I don't remember if I, I did think I told you last night, yesterday, about the yeah, this is my farm stuff I love. Alrighty. Well, like I said, day five. Um, not a huge difference in anything, but I had no difference in the way my skin is, neither, as far as peeling or itching or burning. So, um, I'll upload it on YouTube. I am keeping it tracked, you know, and each day there, along with my makeup tutorial. Um, and I think I might do a tutorial on Lumi, because y'all are really going to like that. I'm going to wait for my firm head to come in. Because um, that's supposed to, you know, take all the dead cell cells, cells off your face. <laughs> Um, so which helps too, you know, to circulate or to, um, boost your collagen and, well, I sound professional, don't I? I don't know what I'm talking about. It just feels good. That's all I know is it feels good. So, um, anyway, so, uh, I will see y'all tomorrow night and I'll let you know how it goes with the, uh, doing the face mask with the 180 and I'll let y'all know then. I'll talk to you later.